Link 2012. The meditation potion. No! 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 <laughs> I put my key in the chest. I put my key in the chest that I used that the keys for. How was I supposed to do anything about it? Okay. Okay. I have an idea. Don't worry. We'll get it out. It's gonna take some trial and error, but we'll get it out. Oh boy. I'm glad I know this trick. Oh, this is gonna take a little while. I have a lot of arrows in there. Oh, it's taking it out space by space. Yeah, I don't care about half this stuff. Wait, is that going back into the, the hopper? Because it is right by the hopper still. Alright, I just want my key. I've been waiting here a little while. All I want is that key. Perfect. Let's go. We're done upstairs. We haven't gotten this stuff yet, though. Which, who knows if it can be opened or not. Yes, it can. There's a lot of snow open there, in fact. There, there's a few chests in here. Just a few. You can open without trouble. I guess it would look awkward if I messed it up. What? How did I miss this? How did I miss this skeleton spotter right there? It's actually really funny. Speed, I don't need that. There's speed too, I'll use it. Nope. Goodbye. It seems as though I'm not getting one hit killed by everything still, so I'm gonna keep these pants on for now. These pants are gonna be super duper handy in the next area. Because the next area is where you get all sorts of madness. I really mixed it up with all the different mobs. So this sign says, TNT storage, caution. Well, you know us in TNT, we love our TNT. Oh, come on. There we go, we're in. Oh boy, uh, I don't remember if I considered trap chests or not. I mean, uh, sorry, not trap chests, um, minecarts. Yeah, I did. No, I didn't. Watch this. <laughs> You still can get explosions in here. Holy moly, that's a lot. More than I was expecting. They can't touch me, thankfully. If only I had a way to kill them all. <laughs> I do. Sally's are not gonna get me because I didn't manually kill one, but that's okay. XP isn't my biggest concern. So that's another way you can get into chests, is by exploding them. And that stone filler isn't actually there. On the uh, original map. I had to add a lot of that in. It was not easy. And I want my TNT. All right. Well, we're pretty much set for the next section. Actually, let me go put some stuff away. We never. Oh, I thought those were hoppers. And as such, I was gonna say, let's go check them.
Oh, no, we don't need those. We need that. We don't need any of this stuff. Okay. Wow, we're almost out of room. Well, I guess we still have our uh, chest. Our how much knockback resistance is this, by the way? 64%, and this is what, 30%? So that gives us... Uh, 90% knockback, 94% knockback resistance. That's quite a bit. Uh, I feel safe with that amount of knockback resistance, to be honest with you. I'm not sure if there's anything in these. I doubt it. Stuff in this area, for sure, though. Which I am honestly afraid of. Yeah, there's explosions everywhere. Oh, and our night visions run out. Hello. Oh boy. Uh, I do not feel safe around those. Well, thankfully, we can always go back through the portal. <laughs> Get night vision again. And then go back and face the same mobs. Oh, never mind. They're all, they all despawned. That's good. That's good. I know they're pretty close to the thing. Oh, boy. I'm glad that we have the, the Blast Protection 5. Along with the full on our chest plate, because those explosions, man, they are not something that. Oh boy. Yeah, you can just drop it from the ceiling. Haha! -ha. I've outsmarted all the mobs in here. Okay, never mind. Ah, uh, they're probably still spawning on my way up there. Let's go take those down, actually. You know, first priority, take down the thing that's exploding everything. Alright, step over there. Look at all those. Torches are originally on the these little things in the map, but at the same time, what they allow me to do is they make it so they don't the the mobs don't spawn closer to the spawner. They spawn farther out, which I wanted. Gives it a more interesting range. All right, so it looks like there's still a few over here. Man, even this one has spawns things. All right. Well, as you can see, it's an like error block on top, along with TNT all around. All right. I was worried that one of them would spawn on me. Looks like they spawned close to me. Okay, thankfully, we have a lot of knockback resistance. I might not be so fortunate for other times. Right. That's taken care of. Whoops! Goodbye. Oh boy, there's something out there, isn't there? Yeah. If only I had an explosive arrow and I shot it at just the right timing. But it doesn't look like there's anything over there, so we might... We'll save it for last. Oh, boy. Oh, if I had hit the ceiling there, I would have been dead, actually. Because I don't even have ender pearls on me. Right, I want to go there. I want to grab everything in there first. Uh, okay, we're down here. Perfect. Uh... Test results. Functional. dead now though. We have a lucid dream as well in here. Uh, Diamond helmet. Uh, the uh, lucid dream is not going to be good. big news to us. I don't... Sorry, yeah, none of those was a huge use. Diamond helmet in particular. Uh, I'm surprised we died so many times on this map to be honest with you. Now, these are all the leaderboard players. Uh, there, this was a TNT Games lobby. You know, I included a lot of stuff in here. Throwbacks to pretty much all the games. Um, and this one was for the TNT Games lobby. Now, 
there were leaderboards everywhere. I didn't want to keep the leaderboards there because they might have exploded. And I wanted to do this thing where these guys are functional test results. So, interesting. Very interesting stuff. I can't remember if TNT works in this region. We can test. Nope. The answer is nope. Is there anything over here, I wonder? Yes, there is something over there. But, I gotta be careful. That is probably ender- there's probably ender pearls over here to be honest with you. Oh, great, we died. Whatever those things are. Oh, well, I'm going to go down. They can't hit me. They can't hit me off right now. I've got that resistance. Oh, there is a spawn over there. Why couldn't we do it easy? Right, well, we're going back in. We really probably should have should go from the top down to the spawner. Of me not getting knockback resistance now, pretty low. Ouch! No, come on. I'm trying to block this off. Well, I can't. Wait, no, if I, if I, if I shoot him up, I can. Maybe. There we go. Well, say goodbye to, uh... A lot of our blocks. <laughs> There's an ender pearl here. We are using it to move it back over. Yeah, and I'm opening this with this right now. I'm not going to bother with anything else. Okay, it was just arrows and stuff? That's lame. Alright, Hinder Pearl. Alright, hopefully that doesn't land in the void. That would be good. Sweet. And let's go ahead and put some of this stuff away. All of it away. We got a lot of heads now. So many heads from all that. I'm really picking it up with giving players recognition. <laughs> On the bright side, we're getting much, much closer to the castle, which is the end of this area. And after this area, I'm going to call it a quiz for today. Um, uh, there's really there's quite a bit left, actually, which is a scary thing. All these heads, man. Oh, sweet. I got two for backpack guy. Um, do I have a light gear yet? Do I have a light skeleton skull? I no doubt do. I can't imagine. Yeah, I see right there is a weird skeleton skull. Why would I not? <laughs> okay. Backpack. Do I have a cherubim's head? I do. Or sorry, an archangel's head. I don't think we can actually get cherubim heads in this. There are cherubims in, in the final area, but... Huh. No, not in the final area, in the final boss. Huh. Do we already have a resist? No, we don't. Huh. Oh, on this top chest right here. Huh. Wow, look at all those heads! Huh. And look at all those heads! And look at all those heads! We've just got so many to go through still. Huh. Man. Alright. Back to the base. Put some stuff away. Where are my firecrackers? There they are. Oops. I did. 
stream. Go down there. Oh boy, let me get into a better position right now before I continue. Okay. We have a lot of wood from that. Glad we have those blocks that guarantee us knockback resistance. That was actually sort of scary. For a moment there, we we got knocked back. I'm not sure if you guys noticed or not. Oh, baby, we have the, the XP spawner, though. That's some high quality stuff. So maybe we'll actually make an XP farm right now. I'm not sure where, though. I'm sure that I forgot. I thought this stuff was used eventually. I'm surprised it never, it never was used in the end. Like there was a, a, a back, uh, you know, those, those, uh, chests that you get in Blizzard. I made an automatic opener for those. Go all the way up. Yeah, we need more space in here. Blast protection three, we really don't need. Stacked golden boots are rare. But all these are somewhat good. Ivory leggings. Normal gold boots. We don't need that. It's hard for me to tell if there's enchants on all these. Alright. I changed my angle and now I can see. A lot of ivory. Okay, we're fine. Let's just leave it at that for now. Most of the things we're going to get from here on out are sets anyways. Right, armor wise, thorns, three. Brilliant. And sharpness? Eh, I really don't care for so much sharpness, but that's okay. I don't know where to put my mist, so I'm just going to put it in here for now. And of course our arrows can all go in here. Okay. Get, I'm going to take care of everything except the which one call it. Spawn. All right, now we got the spawn. Experience spawner. Okay. How are we going to do this? Is the question. Um because you have to be close to it at the same time. Where should I make it? Right. We have a lot of purple stained clay, actually. Let's go grab some more. We're going to make a little platform for it. Right. Is this a good place for it up there? No. Out here? Actually, this would be a bad idea. So, come up here. And then right here, the XP will come to you. I'm not sure about the range on this thing. So we'll have to see. Okay, so I want to make it up here. I think that's high enough. We can always lower this if it isn't high enough. Or raise this if it's too low. All right, so there's our spawner. Oh, beautiful. All right, so this is the very center right here. Let's go ahead and place a special block right there to indicate that this is the center. Wait, how far out do you, does XP spawn, I wonder? Oh, quite a ways out. So if we ever need a little bit more XP to level up, we can always just use this. And it's actually working surprisingly well. Yeah, because last time I did this, when I did this in alpha testing, 
I made the mistake of putting this in the ground, and so as a result, the XP would all get stuck in the ground. But right here, right now, we're not, we are not having any problem collecting the XP. It looks like all of it's coming to us, and it's falling down. Yeah. So as long as we sit here like this, we'll be fine. Now, of course, we don't want to fall off the edge. If I fell off the edge right now, I'd be so salty. I have no ender pearls. It's just another thing that eats up inventory space, man. Just everything in this map eats up inventory space. Wish you could have more. But let's make it a bit fancy. Why not? Right, what do we have in here? I want some stone brick fences. We have any? Anvil parachute. <laughs> oh boy. Um, I don't know what makes this look good, really. Maybe this. Maybe this. Doesn't really fit with the purple, sadly. But what can you do? Of course, it wouldn't be a bad idea to add some some of these around the edges that we could get up, even though we don't need to. Probably ought not to. Okay, where are some slabs there? Stone slabs. And then we can put one more up here. Boom. There we go. I think that's pretty good. We still are collecting all the XP. None of it's falling off. So I think this is a pretty good situation for us. This, well, we really should have used green for, to signify XP. I am not trying to represent something by using purple clay. Let's just get a bunch of chisel stone bricks, though, so that way we can place these as blocks. Um, that's really cool, too, that we have that XP source now. Question is, do we want to use it on anything? Oh, both of these spawner busters are low. Okay, then. Let's go. Let's get back to conquering that portion that seemed much longer than it should have been. I'm glad that we haven't put the backpack in, a back, in the backpack yet. That would have been the worst. Fire goes out faster than I can get it out. All right. Uh, since we have everything figured out in terms of uh, the spawners spawning stuff from the ceiling, I think we're good. In see areas like this, I try to add unique mechanics like that that uh, make it a little bit more challenging. Now, of course, we were able to take down those spawners really easily. Thanks to our... Charisma of Levitation. I normally wouldn't have anything like that. Players... That's an expensive item, to be honest with you. Rune Leggings. I'm really not going to use the Rune Leggings since I have a legendary iron best light. Oh boy, that was... What on earth? There's just so many sneaky strafers right here. What can I do? Oh, 
Oh boy, that was actually really bad. Oh, we need more gap. Going around here. Just going to get that chest for sure. Oh cool, furnaces that are automatically lit. Those are the coolest cut type of furnaces. Oh boy, I just heard some really big booms. Please allow me to enter. Nope. I cannot get those chests. As a matter of fact, there's nothing in here. A big waste of time. Alright. Oh yes, thank you for dropping a like at the right moment. Shot from there we go. Where is, where are the spawners for these guys too? They keep spawning from over here. Oh wow, there's nothing in this window. That was weird, my levitation wasn't working for a moment. My charisma levitation. Yeah, it's the testing. Okay, well... We still have to get all these chests. Okay, we can't quite get in there in this way, but... Yeah, let's get in here. Oh boy, well, look, look at that. There's a lot of... Uh, a lot of fun up there that we are gonna run away from because we our mouse keeps drinking and we are low on health. Okay, Let me get in here. Oh, you could technically use water to put people upstairs. I never noticed that. Right, please drop some. Nothing up here except those spawners, it seems. Well, TNT is nice too. But... I'm actually gonna block this off so we can chill in here for a moment. 